U.S. Science Museum on the First Coast is one of a kind in the United States. Yeah, this might just be the most of Florida museum there is. It's the Mosquito Museum. Our Jessica Clark is on your side tonight showing us what the buzz is all about. So this is the entrance to our Disease Vector Educational Center. Also known as the Mosquito Museum. This is the first facility like this that's ever been built. The brand new interactive insect experience, but you won't get bitten. You know, different games that uh, you could play. In St. John's County. They can try to see like, oh, what stage is that? Is that this one? Oh, wrong. They can be the character and try to figure out which mosquito virus it is. A live red ant wall. Microscopes made just for them. One of the highlights of the museum is this helicopter. It's a replica of what they use when they spray for mosquitoes. You can even see where you're going. The Anastasia Mosquito Control District is the taxpayer supported organization that sprays for and researches mosquitoes in St. John's County. It built this new museum off of State Road 16 in St. Augustine. We've got um, close ups of mosquitoes. Trish Becker is a museum volunteer and an elected mosquito control commissioner. <laughs> The commission she's on received criticism for spending $4 million of taxpayer money to build the Mosquito Museum. Well, Becker's response? This is not just a museum. This is an educational center. And the whole purpose of this building is to follow the Florida statute that we run under from the state. And a part of that is to educate. We want this to be a place where you can come and learn more importantly, have fun while you're learning and get people into the industries, into these different industries. I think it was really fun. Live tiny, tiny things in the microscopes. It was a lot better than I thought. We learned a lot. <laughs> An insect emporium with a message about the big bad diseases mosquitoes spread with a fun factor built in. In St. Augustine, Jessica Clark, First Coast News on your side. Oh, I could just do without mosquitoes, totally. Mm. <laughs> the museum is off I-95 at State Road 16, the exit there. It's open on weekends except for Easter, and from now until July, you can get in free.